Hey guys, Nas here with another video. In this video, I'll be going over what the best in slot gear is for Samurai as of patch 6.05. I included every BIS in the description, so please look there. I didn't forget about those who don't raid, and I have a BIS for you guys too. It'll be pre and post patch 6.1, as you cannot upgrade 590 pieces until the 24 man comes out, in case you're confused. Okay, with that out the way, let's get into this, yeah? So far in Endwalker, most of you should be comfortable with the 2.14 GCD rotation, so we'll go over that BIS first. This BIS has the potential to do the highest DPS, as the highest critical hit rate at a whopping 25.1% and determination at 109.3%. We have 23.6% chance for direct hit rates. This is the build I recommend and the one I'll be working towards as it plays exactly how you've been playing, but with more crits! Next up is the 2.07 GCD BIS. This one has a very slightly lower critical hit rate at 24.9% and determination at 108.5%. It sadly has the lowest direct hit rate at 13.7%, but it makes up for that with a faster GCD. The faster GCD allows us to be ahead of the 2.14 build after 30 GCDs. In a full uptime fight, after you 30 GCDs with the 2.14 build, you would still be waiting for your global cooldown to come back up, but with the 2.07, you're able to do another GCD. With this advantage, we'll have to do a 3 GCD filler combo now instead of 2 to keep our loop intact. The optimal filler here is a Yuki Kaze combo, followed by Yaiten into MP, but if you'll lose an auto attack or if it's not a safe spot in the fight, then a Gecko or Akasha combo will suffice. Lastly is the 2.0 build. I am so excited to try this build because I have fond memories of Fast Samurai back in Stormblood. Even though it doesn't play the same like it used to, I feel like this build has a lot of potential. While it has the lowest critical hit rate at 13.1% and a medium determination of 108.8%, it does bolster the highest direct hit rate at 31.3%. The faster GCD allows us to net a free GCD off of the 2.14 build at only 15 GCDs. This is insane because this Savage Deer has a lot of full uptime fights, which means this build is a real contender. With so much speed comes the unheard of 4 GCD filler. The optimal filler here is to do a Gecko or Kasha combo and then do Yaiten into MP, but if you can't because of where you're at currently in the fight, then do Yuki Kaze twice. Here's a side by side comparison if it'll help you visually see the differences. I want to mention that these builds are less than 1% apart from each other, so unless you're a diehard who wants to mid max every bit of DPS, any build will work for you. Which build would you guys be going for? Let me know down in the comments below and don't forget, if this video brought value to you, please leave a like and consider subscribing to see more. Until the next video, I'll see ya!